Hi, everybody. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to incorporate Zoom into your courses on Schoology. It's a great tool if you want to schedule virtual class meetings ahead of time and give one central location for students to access those links. First, you need to sign out of your Zoom account. You need to do this so that you can affiliate the Zoom account you created with LAUSD. Go to zoom.us and ensure that you are not signed in. For example, I'm not signed in yet. Once you make sure you've signed out, go ahead and navigate to lausd.zoom.us. This is where you need to be. At the bottom, you'll see sign in, configure your account. Go ahead and click on sign in. It auto signs me in because I've already affiliated my account with LAUSD. You are probably going to get a pop-up that asks you to validate your email, which means they'll send you an email. You need to go check your LAUSD email and click on the link to validate it. Once you've done that, go ahead and go to Schoology. In Schoology, you can navigate to courses and click on one of your courses. I'm gonna click on period four. In the materials section of your course, you can add a file, link, or external tool. Zoom is an external tool, and when you click on external tool, you'll see a drop-down menu at the top, which you can scroll all the way to the bottom and find a Zoom meeting. Title, your um, Zoom meeting as your Zoom class hours so that it's really clear for students that that is what this assignment is. And click Submit. Once you click, click Submit, you'll see your Zoom class hours in your materials. Go ahead and click on that. What should populate is a Zoom interface where you can schedule meetings. I'm going to really quickly show you how to schedule a meeting and how it looks like for a student once you do that. Click on Schedule a Meeting. This is for my period four. If this was a linked section, you might want to, in the previous section, um, determine which course you're doing this for. Period four will start to meet on Wednesdays, next Wednesday. April 1st, I'm going to have uh, my period four meet at 8.30 in the morning for half an hour. I do want this meeting to be a recurring meeting. It's going to meet every Wednesday. So I'm going to check this box. It's not daily, it's weekly. And it's not going to repeat every Tuesday. It's going to repeat every Wednesday. So I uncheck Tuesday and check Wednesday. I want to end this on the 29th of April because hopefully we'll be back at school by May 6th. I'm not going to require registration. I'm going to turn on the host video but leave the participant video off so that I can still record this session. Audio should be both so that students can use either their computer or telephone audio. I'm going to enable my students to join before me and I'm going to mute them upon entry so that there's a little less chaos. Click Save. And now your meeting is scheduled. Let me show you what this looks like on the student end. When John logs into this class, what he'll see under Materials is Zoom class hours. When he clicks on it, what he'll notice is that there are Zoom classes scheduled for every Wednesday at 8.30 a.m. He can click Join on each of these sessions, and if I'm there, he'll see me there, as um, will the other students. Thank you for taking this tutorial with me, and that is all for today.